Welcome to this week's Delaware State Chamber of Commerce Legislative Minute. Today, the DFACT will be meeting and we'll find out if there is any additional money for infrastructure in this year's budget. As uh, we discussed last week, the governor had, had made a proposal of some tax and fee increases so we could put more money into infrastructure. Uh, those were very quickly uh, turned down by the members of the General Assembly. Also, uh, so there are a couple bills that are important to the State Chamber of Commerce that we worked on very hard. One is inf uh, the unemployment fund, making sure that we paid off what we owe the federal government before the cost became too high to the business people of the state. That bill passed the House and is now in the Senate, as has the Workers' Compensation Reform Bill, both of which we expect to be hopefully be completed uh, through the Senate and on the governor's desk by the end of this week. There are a couple other smaller bills which are important to certain members. Uh, one is uh, a bill about warning uh, signals on the back of trucks. Uh, we've this is about a two-year negotiation with the uh, sponsor. It will only apply to uh, trucks over 26,000 pounds that are newly registered. Uh, and we met with our, most of our members who have trucks, and they, they seem to be comfortable with that. That what left the House uh, committee this week. We'll be in the House uh, for vote and hopefully into the Senate next week. Uh, also, another bill is uh, one dealing with electrical licensing, uh, which has to do with testing for people who are receiving an electrical license and also where applies to us uh, where people are working on projects who are not licensed. The contractor is to report them to uh, the uh, board which oversees electrical licensing within 10 days of discovery they did not have a license. Small bills but important to our members. Uh, lastly, Wednesday, the end of session legislative brunch, which we do every year in June. The speakers traditionally are the Speaker of the House, who this year is Pete Swartzkopf, and the President Pro Tem of the Senate, who is Patty Blevins. They will update us on where we are with the budget, uh, the operating budget, and the bond bill, and what bills uh, they expect to be working uh, in the next week, uh, and if they expect any changes. Uh, remember, this: we have seven days left. They recess on the morning of July 1st, Monday, July 1st. Anyway, this is that, that's it for this week. Speak to you again next week. Update you on what has occurred. Thank you.